What is up guys, I'm Remote Night Owl and I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So today we're back with a full gameplay video and as promised we are doing uh, documenting old champion kits and we are doing Gallia today. So with the impending uh, Gallia rework due up in about a week and a half, I figured now would be a good time as ever to do it. So up against the Yasuo mid lane, so this shouldn't be uh, too bad of a lane as long as I... Uh, as I can dodge his uh, cues, dodge his tornadoes. So we're against uh, all right team for Galio, but uh, hopefully, hopefully our team, uh, hopefully our team does pretty well. So, it is the day after the impending snow apocalypse on the East Coast. And, uh, doing pretty good. I was actually kind of surprised that uh, shoveling went a bit easier than expected. It was really easy to get the snow up. Despite being uber heavy. So with Gallier's rework coming, I'm really, uh, really looking forward to the uh, to the changes into the kit. I think um, I think they did a lot of lot of good things with him, and uh, I think it's a good uh, peek into what the uh, uh, Vanguard update is going to be and the impending tank update. My favorite thing about his uh, his new kit is, is his. Uh, His uh, his ultimate. Um, let's see how low she is, and just the fact that it's like a more powerful Malphite. Uh, Malphite ult combined with a Pantheon ult. But the other thing too is, it's just the sheer fact that um, it's just the sheer fact that. Uh, Sorry, I'm a little distracted here. It's just the sheer fact that it um, um, has a, an even bigger knockup range than uh, Malphite's ult does. Oh, he caught that. Good job. Sorry, Warwick. Couldn't do much there. So he's gonna shove us in, we're gonna head back here. Actually, you know what, no, not quite. We don't have enough to get our catalyst yet. Yeah, four to one. Not a horrible start, but still wish, still wish we had some more kills. All right, there we go. We got enough for our catalyst, so. Uh, hopefully, now that we have our catalyst, we should be able to keep up, keep up in wave clear because of that ma extra mana we get and the mana regen we get from uh, taking damage. Fortunately, he still has red buff. That's good. That's a good thing. Got a heavy poke. Yep. We got our ultimate. And 
and back so we don't have to worry about her. He's always, he's always, every time it's off cooldown, he's trying to predict that damn, my damn E and my Q. I'm very curious to see how, um, I mean, I know he's up on the PB right now, but I haven't really been paying too much attention to, like, his numbers and stuff. I'm very curious as to, like, how his new uh, new stats are going to stack. Like, I do know the one thing about his passive is bonus magic resistant bonus attack damage, which I think is a bit strange that it's, like, bonus attack damage, but we'll just see what they have to... We'll just see what they're going to do with it. Try not to take too much poke here. Hopefully, is he gonna go do dragon? That son of a bitch. Well, at least we're not gonna miss it. Miss the farm, which is good. Oh, okay. That was actually pretty fucking cool. Get shit on. I can't. I cannot believe he actually hit his ultimate. That's funny. That's fucking hilarious. And hopefully we can translate that into a win. It's my just gonna get another control word. Couple health pots. Get back there before Lane starts pushing it again. That was pretty fucking funny. He's mad. He's mad. I can. You can tell he's just like so aggressive now. Not gonna get that, but we reset the lane. One thing I'm definitely gonna miss about Galio is uh, the fact that his Q right now is the highest base damage in the game at 300 at level 5, I think it is. There's the wind wall. This is making it so predictable. I'm out predicting the predictions. That's that's funny. Got me. Yep, he's tilted. He doesn't want to go on it. Yep, yep, face the wind. Yep, facing the wind. And of course, Warwick's in trouble. Well, not, not much we could do. Our flash is down anyway, so it's not like we have any good engages. Be careful. Really? Really? 
I thought that would hit. the hitbox was that big. Damn. Right, we gotta get our Rod of Ages. Damn. You know, maybe if he would just gank mid. So we should be okay for now. Avalon's have a bot. That was fun. 2 0, we're only 5 kills down. Oh, wow, we got first tower. That's good. Well, he didn't try to win all that. I'm surprised. Of course. He rushes the Phantom Dancer. That's good. Oh, that that sucks. Flash ult off. 
Hopefully we can get this. Nope, maybe not. I really need to go by, so... I can't help you, Kate. Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, it's just starting to fall behind, so hopefully he doesn't. Alright. Grab a couple of those. So, yeah, like I said, 300 base damage on his Q, which is insanely high. seconds on all oh. oh hey Evelyn you know I keep telling you guys that my ult has a cooldown but you know don't want to listen I wish he would have gone in on that. I'm actually beating him in farm too, that's kind of funny. Well, it is melee versus melee, but still. Good. Our macros, our macros, pretty good. Two zero and four right now. All right. All right. What do we want to try and do? Yeah, I was about to say maybe that's something we want to think about doing. Get top tower. Just keep the macro going. We're actually beating them in towers, even though we're losing in kills. Right, yeah, we're gonna back off this. Do we have enough? Yeah, we have enough for a Bristle Scepter. I'm not going to have my ult for a while. Come on, kill the bitch. Dubstep Ignite, where's the Dubstep Ignite? Oh, how is she so fast? Holy shit. Can 
not believe I wasn't able to get the ignite off. There we go. Alright, well, we got tower, which is the important part. Up next, we're going to be getting tankier randomins and spirit visage. Sell that. A couple of those. Bolt and flash up. Oh, I burned flash already, too. Oh, <laughs> bitch got lit. Up. That's awesome. Get the farm. That works. Get the dragon, get immediately back to safety. This is a fun game. Up in a minute seven. Yeah, when wall that. Funny, I keep pinging them when my shit is on cooldown, and they keep fighting. See if I can make a play like a god. Nope, no bearing yet. Doing this? Good job. Now we're going to save the E. Are we going to 
gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. Stay on it, stay on it. Bada bing, bada boom. Good job. Good shit. Good shit, guys. That was a beautiful ult. Right, you got. Want to save Flash? Definitely want to save Baron too. Right, I need to go back and buy. Tank items here. Got that. Got one of those. And I just keep getting more ability power. Isn't it wonderful? Alright. Alright. Ocean Drake coming up. up in 50. Oh, okay, that was a bit sketchy there. Even I'm just like... That pull was a bit off, if you ask me. Are you kidding me? Can't believe she was able to get that off. Yeah, well, can't do much there, but you know what? Warwick, or not Warwick. <laughs> Friggin', uh. Oh, are they backing off? Oh! Wow, we're gonna have another chance to win this. You should be able to get that. Hopefully we don't get backdoored here. Just 
we have... Yep, decent amount of ability power. Oh, come on! Pulling a unicorns of love here? I think we are. We could do this. Oh, how is Kate not able to get that second wind or er, motion drake? No, oh, whatever. Or not Kate, friggin' ribbon. we can get Baron without a back door. Right, drop that there. Understand what you guys are doing. that and then probably guardian angel so get that get that yeah and we want to get the magic resist first for more ability power
Oh, this game's going forever. Oh, good, they didn't get that ward. Shit. This is unbelievable. Uh, I don't want to say anything too late now, but hopefully... Hopefully, I think we're gonna win. I mean, Blitzcrank is up in 15 seconds, but... God, Unicorns of Love. Oh my god, this game. This is literally a Unicorns of Love game. Wait, this is what I hate. Just end the freaking thank you. Thank you. Well, couldn't have asked, honestly, for a better game to get ga old Galio into the history books here. But there you go, guys. Uh, and I hope you all enjoyed watching. But anyway, as always, we'll see each other again real soon. Have a wonderful day.